Wave video tutorial for beginners how to use Wave video online video editor. Hello guys, Ilya here and in this video I'm going to show you how can we use Wave video to create our own videos online. Basically it's pretty easy, just follow these steps I do to not make any mistakes. So they provide us a lot of different features with different templates of course. In order to get started we need to visit wave.video and here we are on our homepage. We can click on sign up sign in or create video anywhere basically so let's click on sign up and i'd like to continue with google it's the easiest way as for me so you can do the same and after that we'll come to our home page basically in the left side menu we have my projects my stream and recording and my uploads of course also there is like templates folder where we can find a lot of different templates with different categories in my projects area there is like option to find all of your projects you created so you can continue working on the same project you are like would like to start with basically we can click a new one by simply uh, clicking on create and here we can choose what would we like to do i'm going to show you how we cre can create blank video from scratch so let's click on it and here we need to choose our video format if you're going to create video for youtube choose horizontal for youtube shorts or instagram stories or instagram reels choose the vertical one or maybe tiktok so i'm i'm going to show you how can we create horizontal video for example for our our YouTube channel so basically we'll come to our editor page and as you can see there is like the first step we need to do is just to edit our media so let's choose it from our library or upload media so let's click on upload video and here we are on our computer we need to choose something we'd like to upload I'm going to upload this one so here we can change the duration of our video let it be like only 10 seconds part so I'm just going to click on upload it may take a little time but everything is done really quick as you can see so uh, here we are on our editor in the left side we can a switch between like different sizes also we can choose some different templates we can go to stocks to find some stock maybe media with videos pictures and so on on our edit page we can find our timeline and our editing area also there is like layout options we can add different layouts as you can see we can add some stuff like for text or for, for for some other reasons also we have the option to add text all i'm going to talk is like about this left side menu overlays stickers watermarks uh, audio and caption also there is like option to work with audio storyboard and in enters so this is the way Basically, if you'll we'll click on our video right up here and we'll go to edit, we can find a lot of editing details we can customize on our editor. So for example, here we can change the size, we can increase, we can change the speed, of course, uh, we can change the volume. So I'd like to mute the whole audio clip. We can also add fade in and fade out, fade out. Sometimes it could be helpful if you want to make it like more smooth as for you. Also, we can add like color filter if we like. Basically, it's about like opacity, you know. Uh, also, we can trim our video. If you'll click, we'll come to this page where we can customize all the duration. I already did it, so I want to do this. And of course, we can crop. I'm going to crop for a little because as you can see, I have some black like you no know, lines uh in the top and in the bottom so i'm just i'm just going to click on done and now everything is done basically uh we can also go to layouts add some layouts i want to do this and i'd like to add some text also if you'll we'll click on text area we can find a lot of text templates in the right side i'm going to find something which is suitable as for this video so let's try to use this one for example I already clicked and our text has appeared on our timeline so now we can change the duration by clicking on the corners and then just move to the necessary position let it be like this in order to customize text we need to choose it right up here and i'm going to input like the name of our channel uh let it be like helper mom and i'm going to change the size as you can see helper mom tutorials and uh, let it be like for beginners 
let it be like this. As you can see, the process is quite simple. Moreover, if we'll click on something here, we can customize, you know, the text size. We can change, like, add some more text. And basically, if we'll choose it here, we can choose this font style. We can add some background or do some other stuff. We can change the alignment. We can add some text effect, we can add some background style and so on. So basically all the editing part is right in the right side here. So all you need to do is just to come here by yourself and try to do and try to do this. So basically that's all. Also we can just simply work with timeline here. As you can see we can cut our part video. So now it's divided into two different parts. We can work with uh, duplication or we can just simply delete so if it's necessary let's try let's try to delete this part and now we only have like five seconds video right up here so it's like the intro for our channel we can use it like this basically so when everything is done all we need to do is just to click on publish in the right top corner here and what can we find here we can find a lot of different options like download mp4 we can create gif create from segment and so on so i'm going to click on create video Video, and after that the process will begin we need to choose a resolution right up here let's choose the highest one which is like available 720 and the video format here and then I'm just going to click on render with watermark so if you don't want to have like a watermark on your uh, you know video we can upgrade our options as you can see we can uh, compare plans and we have like uh, four of them the first one is totally free as you can see but we can use it only with like watermark also there is like streamer plan creator and business the difference is it's not that big so if you are going to use like the video for a long time i suggest you to use maybe creator plan so as you can see we can uh, upload videos up to 30 minutes we can also use the thumbnail maker sometimes it could be really helpful especially for youtube videos also we'll have access to our stock library with 200 million assets and templates we can also stylish captions and subtitles image backgrounds removal and text-to-speech options also is like all the features from streamer and uh, free plan so I think this is the most suitable as for the guys who are going to use it for a long time. So this is a way basically of how can we uh, use and work with wave.video video editor. So basically that's all for this video. I hope guys this video helped you out. If it is, please leave a like, comment and subscribe. Of course, if you have any questions, you can write them in the comments below. And that's all for this video. Hope you all are doing great and I wish you a very, very good day and goodbye, guys.